So the first of the nine MLA eight elements is the author. And it hasn't changed significantly except for one minor thing, which I will explain shortly. Um, typically, author is last name first comma first name last period, as in the Bill Egan example. If you have two authors, you'll do last name first comma first name last comma and then use the conjunction and first name first and last name last period. If you have three or more authors, you are only going to mention the first author and then place a comma after the first name and spell out ET space AL period at al, which means and others in Latin. Organizations can be authors too, and these are called corporate authors. A very common one that you will see um, in your global history curriculum here at New Canaan High School is the Central Intelligence Agency. So in this first instance, you can see that there is no author. The author would be in yellow and there is no author. So we just leave that out and go straight to the next item in the list of elements. In the second one, I had mentioned this earlier, this author is the Central Intelligence Agency. And in this instance, you can see that you have two instances of the same author, in which case the second author is not listed or spelled out. You just put in three dashes and a period, and then you go straight to the title of the source.